This guy is the editor of the Aristocrats. You make us give us a lot of noise. You gotta give him the energy. Give him the energy. Give him the love. Give it up for Emery. Emery, give it up. to start right off with, uh, I'm not bragging when I tell you this, but I once paid $6,100 for a girl to watch me on Instagram. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I think she dug it. Yeah. Oh, God damn it. I'm not usually the kind of person to succumb to peer pressure, uh, but tonight I do want to open up and be honest with you about something. Um, uh, I too was molested by my uncle, and it's all right, I'm over it, relax. Not a problem. I, uh, I do want to share that story with you, especially since you've already seen another comic talk about this. And she talked about how men will not talk about that. Well, I'm here to tell you, I am a man who will indeed talk about this. You are allowed to laugh at whatever jokes I share with you through this journey. I'm fine. You not laughing does not unrape me. So, <laughs> I was molested by my uncle. It was uh, started when I was five. The grooming began, and uh, uh, the, the, he, it didn't stop till I was 14. Nine years I was molested by an uncle, which is really shitty because that's the longest relationship I've ever been in. And that's <laughs> why I can't keep a relationship together. <laughs> it's horrible the night he broke up with me. I'll never forget that. <laughs> he came in my room, three in the morning, woke me up. I think we need to see other relatives. <laughs> my sister stole my uncle. What the fuck, man? We had other uncles. Why'd she... <laughs> It was confusing, you know, when you're a guy and you get molested by a, a, a guy, a family member, you, you find yourself at some point questioning your own sexuality. You know what I mean? I, I, it didn't take me long to figure out, you know, I, it, I really narrow, I, I, I'm not fucked up from it. My sister is, is an absolute mess from all the way to the grave. She will be a nightmare because of what happened to her. But for me, it was easy to figure out. My uncle did a bad thing and I got laid a lot. That was it, I was done. <laughs> Trying to figure out if I was gay, it didn't take long to figure out I'm bisexual. Um, that's all I needed to figure out. And then I was I was done and he, fuck him. And my sister told the family, um, right? Yeah, 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 no, no. Uh, um, she was talking about how she's gonna tell the family. Don't tell the family, is what I'm saying. Don't even bother, Miranda. My sister told the grandparents, the, the, the people who raised the guy who molested us, and my grandmother, Grandma Skinner, literally said, when did this start? And Cronessa said, four years old for her. She was one year younger than me, five for Emery. And she goes, I remember that. You were all over him like a snake. Oh. Yeah, they're not all jokes. I'm just sharing. I'm just talking. <laughs> so I'm with Miranda. Uh, if you have been molested, whether you're a guy or a girl, fucking talk about it. And if I left you with any message on this point, you do not have to live your life fucked up. Whoever fucked you is the asshole. You are not guilty of anything. You are the victim. Move on with your fucking life. And I'm proud to say I could take a cock today. Shit. My prostate looks like Rocky Balboa. In the later episode. <laughs> I am a fag. And I'm allowed to say that, by the way. 
I can use the F slur if I want because I am one. That's the rules of engagement, so I'm living by the rules of engagement. Uh, when I say that, I, uh, uh, I've sucked a lot of cock. I can say facts. Uh, and I don't even like sucking cock. I just really like saying facts. Uh, give me some rules, I'll live by them. <laughs> Awesome. Usually this material sucks. <laughs> I was going to the grocery store the other day. Uh, we're still in a pandemic. You're wearing a mask. I was wearing my mask. I actually have my, have my little uh, uh, hand sanitizer hanging from my belt. And this, 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 this guy was offended. And literally he, he goes, beta cook. <laughs> For wearing a mask, that's it. I didn't say anything. I just walked by the fucking guy. I'm a beta cut. I'm not a beta cut. Ask my girlfriend. Ask my girlfriend's boyfriend. He'll tell you. Hi. Hi. I'm an alpha cuck. Goddamn right. I take my girlfriend to a bar. If you won't fuck her, I'll kick your ass. I'll take her right you faggot. I'll tell you. <laughs> yeah, I'm bi I'm, I'm a polyamorous bisexual atheist. That's a weird combination. <laughs> yeah, which means I'm the only one who has to walk into a bar for this joke. <laughs> oh Lord, don't you hate when your watch doesn't come on when you flip it over? What the hell, man? Steve Jobs is dead. <laughs> I bet you saw it. I clicked up right over. No, it still didn't come on. Fuck you, man. I, um... Being polyamorous is weird. You know, everybody... All my friends, when they found out I was polyamorous, they're like, Yeah! You're, you're, you must get so much pussy! Uh, I, uh, I, mm -mm. Um... <laughs> No, it's just twice as depressing. You come home and two or three girlfriends and none of them want to fuck you. That is not happening. Did I get a blowjob tonight? Fuck off. <laughs> Being polyamorous, my, uh, my favorite drug, my drug of choice would be uh, Molly. That's the perfect drug if you got to fuck a lot. And uh, <laughs> I think all drugs should be legalized. Anybody feel like uh, yeah. every one, every goddamn one, heroin? Let the fuck kill yourself. I don't give a shit. <laughs> every drug, especially the non-addictive drugs. Molly is not addictive. Uh, mushrooms are not addictive. There is no reason the government should be up in our shit about mushrooms. If you were all on shrooms right now, I wouldn't even have to say anything. I could walk out and stand here. You would get the fucking joke. <laughs> yeah. I have a... Uh, one of my girlfriends is a stutterer. Man, stutterer. You have not dated a stutterer. Find one, get one. Fuck it. I, that, these. Woo! One night, my girlfriend, she goes, she goes, I, 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 I didn't want you, want you to come in my, like, spit it out. You, ladies and gentlemen, have been the best audience I have ever dishonestly catered to. Thank you. Enjoy the rest of the show.